annual Cub Scout Soapbox Derby. Now these Cub Scouts turn race car drivers for the day, range from first to fifth grade. They're ready to do their best and get to racing. You guys ready to have a good time to get to it? Yeah. All right, I want to have one cheer before we get going. Uh, let's go with this. I'll say Cub and you'll say Scouts. Cub. It's more of a family thing where all the kids come out and really enjoy it. And the way we do it is we do two or three practices to show how the kids want to participate. So the more the kids come out and show participation, those, that's how we get to choose who runs the cars the most. What strategies do these boys have today or what do you tell them? What kind of prep talk? The speed talk because you don't want the kids sitting up in the air. So you want them tucked down. You don't want them to oversteer the vehicle because if you steer oversteer down the course, you're doing a longer course and obviously you don't want to press the brake before the finish line. How excited are you for this event? Oh, it's a very nice thing. My, my son loves it a lot. We've been here last year and uh, we are very much looking forward to race down here this year again. Well, prep talks. I saw you over there. What are you telling your son? That he just has to go straight and make it down there. Everything is fine. As long as he has fun here, that's the most important thing. There are many other packs coming in here, so it's not just the two El Segundo packs that we have here, but all over the area, San Pedro is here. So I think for El Segundo, this is a this is a very special event and an important event for the community here to, to show that there is presence here for the Cub Scouts. They just need to practice to make sure that they don't crash uh, <laughs> into the haystacks. Otherwise, he's good to go. I mean, like I said, he thinks he's the expert driver, so we shall see. There was supposed to be a red stripe because we didn't have blue, but then we accidentally put some right here. And my brother said it sort of looked like a Red Bull, so then we called it the Red Bulls. How special is this event? Oh, this is my favorite day of the year. I look forward to this every year. A chance to get the Cub Scouts out here, racing those cars down the hill, on, you know, on a public street, it's fantastic. With all their family here, their parents cheering them on, it's an amazing day. We've been doing this for 36 years, since 1981. And uh, I, you know, I like to think, and I think the city agrees, I think we're just a part of the city now. It's, it's you know, as special as Candy Cane Lane or the Holiday Parade or any of those events that happen every year. But the Cub Scout motto is do your best. And that's what we want. We want them to come out here and do their best. They're not all going to be the fastest down the hill, and some of them might not make it all the way down the hill. But they're going to try their best, and they're going to have a good time doing it, and that's what it's all about. I want all of these young boys to walk out of here screaming, I can't wait to do it again next year. And that concludes another year of the Soapbox Derby here in El Segundo. And these Cub Scouts are ready to race again next year. Reporting for El Segundo TV, I'm Tolly Anderson.